Hi, Ted Brooks with MagLogix. Here to talk to you a little bit more about the incredible technology that MagLogix and our German partner Alpha are bringing to the marketplace today. We'll start off with our family of lifters. Right now we have three of them. Our smallest one weighs only about four pounds. It's designed in this particular case to be a hand lifter with an incredibly sturdy metal handle. What this does, it allows you to grab, whether it's vertically in shear, whether it's horizontally for a straight lift, all the weight that OSHA will let you safely carry. This has about 800 pounds of breakaway, so I'm not worried about picking up a 66 or 70 pound piece of steel and carrying it around all day long. This magnet will hold it for you. It does have a bigger brother. The bigger brother is the TML 250. These are rated in kilograms, so let me do the conversion for you real quick. That's about 550 pounds of safe working load, and we always rate our magnets at three to one. Do not be confused by safe working load of some competitive magnets that might rate theirs at two to one. That's just an artificially inflated number. So a three to one, 550 pounds, means this magnet has an ultimate breakaway of about 1,700. The really incredible thing is it does that even on quarter almost, at three inch steel, you get full power. And it weighs in at a whopping eight pounds. That's a huge advantage. That means you can transport it. You can take it from hook to hook in your shop. You can take it off the hook and use it around the shop for fabrication. We'll talk more about that in a minute. And of course, our TML 250, Total Material Lifter, has a big brother as well. And that's the TML 500. 500 kilograms, about 1,100 pounds of safe working load. That gives this monster about 3,300 pounds of breakaway. Again, a three to one, about 1,100 pounds of safe working load. It still weighs in at an amazing 15 pounds for the greatest power to weight ratio the industry has ever seen. Once again, it gives you full power, basically three inch steel, an unbelievable power and even quarter inch and below. When I say take these off the hook and use them, it's so important. When you have a mag that only weighs 15 pounds or eight pounds or four pounds, don't put it at the end of a hook and leave it there. I know they look great that way, but that's wasting an awful lot of the money you spent for them. Take it off the hook, bring it over to two pieces of plate steel, turn it on and watch those high-low mismatches disappear in an instant. They're so compact, they're so easy to turn on. You can start to do things you can never do before, like use lifting magnets, whether it's for lifting or fabrication, even on the thin and compact areas of webbing of an I-beam. Turn it on with one finger, no problem at all. When you're using it vertically, this may be supporting a very heavy piece of steel you need to use. Just has enough residual magnetism to hold its own weight, not enough to bother you, not enough to make it tough to take off. Just enough to hold its own weight, get in position, put it exactly where you want it, and simply turn it on to hold heavy pieces of steel. How much can these guys hold when doing fabrication? Let me show you a good example. I'm gonna grab this little hand lifter. Again, about 800 pounds of ultimate breakaway. You'll never lift that much, I hope. I'm gonna put it on right here. Simply turn it on. This is the kind of weight these guys can hold, a lot more than OSHA would ever let any of us hold. Unbelievable power, incredible holding force, even on thin metals. That's what the MagLogix magnets from Alpha are all about.